Denver 7 On Demand is brought to you by Ferguson and BAC Appliance Center. The best in bath, kitchen, and lighting for your home. I'm Jacqueline Allen with the latest from Denver 7. West Point cadets could be in trouble today. They stole the Air Force Academy's live mascot, a falcon, and hurt it. The two schools played each other in football Saturday. Military schools have a tradition of stealing each other's mascot before the game, but this time the Academy's 22-year-old white gyro falcon, Aurora, suffered potentially life-threatening injuries. That bird apparently had some kind of a wing injury after being taken by the Army cadets. Reports out of Colorado Springs say the falcon might need to be euthanized because of its injuries. In Eagle, police are investigating homophobic bumper stickers on Jared Polis campaign signs. The Democratic gubernatorial candidate is a gay man who's married with two children. Police tell us they've identified who made more than 2,000 anti-gay stickers, but they don't have the evidence that that person used those stickers to deface the signs. And for the first time, a marijuana-based medicine has been approved by the FDA. It's called Epidiolex. It's used to treat seizures related to epilepsy. Now, the drug is being made with a plant derivative, which lacks the high that comes with marijuana. So the medicine has been approved for use in patients aged two years and up. And from the First Alert Weather Center, here is a look at your forecast. We have some storms on the way, so we will see some rain and snow throughout the week. And this has been your Denver 7 On Demand update. Thank you for joining us. Check back here later for another update and download the Denver 7 app for breaking news and alerts. I'm Jacqueline Allen.